Hello, hello, and welcome to another round of First to Worst. I will be your moderator slash commentator, Dragon on Your Shirt. And today we have Hoyt versus Ralph Sauce. This is going to be an interesting match because Ralph Sauce is doing a one hit run. So this, this will be very interesting. Uh, before we kick things off, do you two have anything you'd like to say to each other? Good luck. Good Don't luck. Hit. We'll see. <laughs> okay, so with that being said, uh, you guys can go ahead and start picking your weapons. Remember, you have three <laughs> rerolls if you're not satisfied with what you have. I'll take it. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah. Nice. We'll uh, go ahead and wait for Hoyt to catch up with his latency, and then I will do the ready, set, go, and set you loose. All right. Awesome. So when you guys are ready, tell me you're ready, and I will tell you to go, and that's when I will set you loose on the hot dogs out there. Ready. I'm ready. All right. And go. Now, keep in mind, folks, uh, Ralph Sauce's stream is about to go blank as I mute in death and um. So please forgive me. <coughs> Okay, and, and they are off. Go. Now keep in mind, folks, uh, Ralph Sauce's stream is about to go blank as I mute indefinitum. So please forgive me. Damn, I did not want to hear myself there. <laughs> All right, well, anyway, with that being said, our two contestants are off. Hoyt quickly taking control. Of the hold, knocking those so sigs out. They both are starting off with some very with some very strong loadouts, except for Ralph Sauce has grabbed himself the single barrel shotgun. Let's see. Looks like Hoyt has picked himself up the SIG P3. P350 chambered in 45 ACP. Giving her a few, giving it a good uh, sound check. And Hoyt has just jumped into his first hold. Analyzing system. With Ralph Sauce right behind him. Both of them taking up a. Hoyt taking up a interesting position down at the bottom of the stairs while Ralph Sauce is grinding along the edge. We'll see how this plays out. Looks like Ralph is looking to take take advantage of that weird lineup, and Hoyt's statics are up, having a little bit of problems. All right, ooh, that was. Ooh, they both finish. They both finish their holds at the same time, but it looks like Ralph Sauce was able to finish off his a little bit faster than Hoyt. see here. Hoyt, Ralph, uh, Ralph Soft's taking quick control of the supply point. It looks like Hoyt has the option to roll a submachine gun. That texture repeat is really obvious. Wait, yeah. yeah, Anton, why you gotta be such a lazy dev with all these texture repeats? Come on, man. <laughs> uh... We like the clown here. Let's see here. So, Ralph Sauce picking himself up a. Rolling a Taz with that uh, one point shotgun. Uh, that's kind of a. Uh, that kind of blows. I have no idea what he plans to do with it, but he's got it. Uh, 
right. Quite about ready to jump into his second hold. And he is in it. And ladies and gentlemen, just to let you know, technically, Route Sauce is our third one-hit run. The uh, last two one-hit runs was a head-to-head -head between Ethium 101 and Shiny Cat. Both of them agreed to do a one-hit. And Hoyt Hardens are up. He is taking out one, two, three. Coming around the corner. Slow down a little bit by that last one. Advancing to next system lane. Analyzing system. Bear in mind, everybody, just because Ralph Sauce is... If, if Ralph Sauce does die in this one hit, he loses the multiplier. So if he can survive, he's almost a guaranteed win. And Ralph Sauce has just jumped into his hold. We'll go ahead and focus in on the both of them. All right. Ralsaw's taking quick control of the ro of the hallway. Poor guy is stuck with a very... He's not catching an easy break with his loadout, but he is making the Taz bolt action 20 gauge shotgun work for him. And it looks like Hoyt has just finished his second hold, so we'll focus over on Ralph. See how he does. Right. Ralsaw is taking out those Sosigs as fast as he can so they can't get the drop on him. That's the one thing about playing one hit is if that it is so much more tense and as soon as those Sosigs start shooting at you it's it is a rush of adrenaline because just one bullet will end his run. All right, patiently waiting for his swarms to pop up. Oh, and it looks like they just popped up. Struggling with that fur furthest one. Oh, shit. Having a little bit of problems getting to his second gun. All right, he took, he's taken out his uh, first. He's got his second, and he's got his third. And he has oh, finished his uh. second hold. Meanwhile, Hoyt is not too far away from starting up his hold, but it looks like he's going to go to the next supply point. I wonder what kind of meat I'll right. And it would appear that uh, Ralph has the option for a mag, a rolling magfed shotgun. That is. And Hoyt has just acquired himself a. M4 Tactical with 30 round magazines. That is a really nice start. And it appears it is the M4 left hook as well. Unfortunately, I don't think Hoyt is a lefty from the looks of things. Meanwhile, Ralph has just rolled himself the VZ58 Tactical, which, in my opinion, for my preferred play style, is a really nice roll, but for everyone else out there, they probably despise it. Override token found. All right. Ralph Sauce heading to the next supply point. Point upgrade inst already upgrading to the hundred round tombstones. It's uh. It's really discouraging to see uh, Ralph Sauce pl playing the harder difficulty and also getting the uh, not so not so great roles either. He Ralph is at a major disadvantage here, uh, loadout wise. Blue tips, yes, please. 
See, that's the one issue with the uh, with the VC is you can only upgrade it up to 30 round magazines, and it is not compatible with AK mags for some reason, despite looking very similar. All right, and Hoyt has just jumped into his third hole. All right, we'll see what he is up to. He is instantly taking control of the yellow pit room, eliminating any Sosigs that walk in. All right, and his hardens that are up. Let's see, he's making quick work of them, just spraying and praying them down until they, until they bust. Advancing to next layer. Taking a few practice shots, it looks like. Analyzing system. All right. Point back at it again, making sure no Sosigs step into his room. That room is his, and he intends to keep it that way. Meanwhile, Ralph Sauce is really taking the time to make sure he has a formidable loadout to carry him as far as as far as he can past the uh, third hole. But that VZ should do the trick for him. All right, and Hoyt swarms are up, and that was a really quick swarm clear Advancing from Hoyt. And with that M4 attack, with that M4 left hook, he should be able to take out the recursive encryptions with no problem. As long as he can maintain very, very well skilled aim. In the meantime, Ralph Sauce is taking the time to gooch out his VZ, giving it as many upgrades as he, as he can. Alright. It's, uh, it's getting really tense. With uh, the intensity of how long it's taking for these recursives to pop up, this, and they're up, and that was a buttery smooth recursive takeout. Meanwhile, Ralph Sauce has just jumped into his third hold. All right. This is going to be really tense for Ralph Sauce because if he takes one hit, it is it is game over for him. Big question to all the people out in the chat: Does anyone else, on occasion, find themselves waiting forever for a for an encryption to pop up? Speaking of which, Ralph's hardens have just popped up, and that was a very quick takeout. Ralph Sauce taking a a strong position there over by the corner. Trying really hard to take these Sosigs out before they even enter the room. Being very careful not to catch any flying bullets. Ralph Sauce waiting forever on those recursives, which should pop up in any second. And in the meantime, Hoyt had just jumped into his... Ooh, these are the swarms. And meanwhile, Hoyt is already in his fourth hole. Keep in mind, just because Hoyt finishes first does not mean he wins. He still has to have the better score. However, he is keeping really good pace. But... Ralph Sauce is doing a one-hit spawn lock, so the multiplier is heavily in his favor. He just needs to stay alive, if, any, if anything. 
system. Right. Poi trying to maintain full control of the purple stair purple stair room. And at the same time, Ralph is also trying to maintain control of the yellow pit room. And his and it sounds like Ralph's and curses are up. He is taking a little bit of extra time to be very careful with those. And he is finished. Meanwhile, Hoyt over here is already working on his already made it to his self which are already up and he is just praying and praying for them and he is made it past the stealth now it is on to the agiles and with the m4 left hook with those 100 round tombstones it is looking really good for him Ralph Sauce trying really hard to clear out all these so sigs so he doesn't catch any flack on his way to the fourth hold. Looks like they're closing in on him, trying to corner him. King, is it a good thing that you forgot or is it a bad thing? Because you have just made in time to see the third one hit run of the tournament. Ralph Sauce you running a one hit spawn lock with Hoyt as a standard spawn lock. Mm. Yes sir, and Hoyt's Agile has just popped up. He's taking them out, having a little bit of having a little bit of problems with that second one, and he is done. Meanwhile, it looks like Hoyt has just jumped into his fourth hole in the meantime. We'll go ahead and we'll focus on him and see how he's doing. Ooh, this is... Ralph Sauce may be a little bit behind, but that was because he was taking the time to make his VC as best, as, as good as it can be. Trying to take out the recursive encryption, and he's got it. I I hate to say it, but if Ralph Sauce can actually make it through this round, he he wins the, he he wins this round. There's no doubt about it. With how well he is keeping such good pace with those encryptions, doing a really good job staying on top of those SOSIX. The only thing that could end this now is if he catches one flying bullet or a Sosig throws one grenade just a bit too close. It appears in the meantime, uh, it looks like Hoyt managed to pick himself up, uh, Two, two ARs in the in the meantime. All right, and Ralph Sauce's stealths are up. He is trying really hard to get control back of the room while being able to take out those stealths, playing it safe, focusing on the so six, looking for the stealths, and he is on to the agiles. Looks like he was able to pick himself up a, ooh, a double snail drum with, uh, what is that? Yes, sir, the, the man is akimbo. In the meantime, Hoyt is akimboing M4 Tacticals with a 100 round tombstone and a double snail drum. That is a very interesting setup he has. All right, and Hoyt has just jumped into his fifth hole. We'll go ahead and we'll see how he's doing.
Yes, he could just use one of the mags, but it looks like Hoyt really appreciates variety. All right, and Ralph's agiles are up. Ooh, Sosa just snuck up on him, working on his fourth. Ooh, trying to get a flying shot in, struggling with the magazine. Oh, is he going to get it? It's dancing right above him, and he has it. Ralph Sauce is on the way to his fifth hold, and meanwhile, Hoyt is working on his. Ooh, this is this is a very very tense match. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, Ralph. But you can't you can't do the cool tactical reloads. I, I wish, but all right. Looks like uh, Ralph tried to upgrade his VC magazines, which only go as high as 30 rounds. And Hoyt's Agiles are up. Looks like he was working his way up into the speed meet round. And he has, Hoyt has made it past speed meet. Ladies and gentlemen, he is practically in, guaranteed to complete his run. Meanwhile, Ralph is on his way. Looks like he's uh, going to take the time, do some shopping, maybe clear out those SOSIGs around the hold so we can safely get into it. Meanwhile, Hoyt is taking, is just demanding control of the T hallway. Looks like the man is looking around, trying to get himself a better, better assault rifle than the VC. And he managed to roll himself the... I do not remember what that's called, but it is essentially the AR-15 shotgun. I'm sure someone will correct me in what its real name is, but... It's, it's practically an AR shotgun. Ch change my mind. And it looks like he's got the five round magazines for it. Alright, and Hoyt's regenerative are up, taking it out taking them out with exceptional speed. Hmm. That was that was a really nice regenerative takeout. And it looks like the man is sitting with a score of what is that? Returning to interface. That almost looks like a 198, 199, maybe. We'll have to see. And in the meantime, we'll go ahead and we'll bring our camera around to Rolf Sauce, who still has yet to get to his fifth hold. Looks like he's upgrading the uh, upgrading the magazines for his uh, for his uh, AR shotgun. And unfortunately, that is not the USAS. The, uh, it's close, but not quite. Let's see, I would, I would definitely think about taking the power up. Yes, sir. <laughs> that is, you are going to want that for either the speed meet or the regenerative. It's okay. I also forget the names, but I know what they are and I know how it's supposed to work. Honestly, there are so many different gun names out there with so many model types, variants. It's easy to forget. All right. Meanwhile, Ralph Sauce is quickly taking control of the T hallway. He's going to need to maintain that control if he wants to wants to complete this round. All right, and his, the stealths are up. He is taking quick control, taking them out as fast as he can. One Sosa coming around the corner, surprising him. Uh, he's gonna need, he's going to need to find that. Uh, oh, there it is. He found it. But there's one Where more the hiding on him. Yeah, I'm thinking the same thing. Ooh, did he? I don't think, I don't think he was <sighs> hit. I think he got really lucky on that one. 
That was really lucky. That so sick could have ended his run right there. Oof. Keep keep in mind, he lo even if even if he dies right here right now, he still loses his multiplier. He will need to complete the run if he wants to continue on to the next round. All right, still maintaining control of the speed meet round. Man, every every time, every time I hear a Sosa go off, I just, I fear for this man's life. All right. Activating his ghost hot dog. Trying to take out the Agiles while the Sosigs are none the wiser, and he is done. Man, honestly, the only thing that, uh... The only thing that's scarier than a SOSIG or a AA-12 when you're playing one hit is the floating knife. And I believe this is only if you're playing on playful gravity settings. But I've heard some people have been, have their whole one hit runs have been ended by just a knife on the floor. It is, it is a very intense way to play the game. All right, having a little bit of tr having a little bit of troubles uh, taking out those uh, breacher boys. All right, ooh, he ooh, that that so sick is putting some serious pressure on him. Switching to a shotgun, trying really hard to take him out. Oh, ah, oh, it's so tense. All right, and his regenerative is up. He's going to need to find it. He's getting shot at. Either that's so sick, that, that's so sick was a really, really bad shot, but he has made it. Five Whew, I did that, it. I lost that, my shotgun. That was really, really intense, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I guess while you're at it, okay, so Ralph Sauce's stream is going to go down because I have to unmute everybody. So, give me a good second. Okay. So. Okay. Hello, hello. How are you guys feeling right now? Well, how do you do? After after I uh, finished and realized that I wasn't immediately pulled into the voice chat, I think Ruffle Sauce, did you finish? He I finished. He did. All right. Finish. Great job. Okay, Thank so you. with that being said, I'm going to need to uh, ask you both to do me a big favor and stare at your score so I can get those logged in really quick. Yep. Okay, so. What'd you get, Hoyt? 199210, new PB. Oh man, you would have definitely beat me if I had not done a one hit. There was no way. Oh I would have man, you still beat yeah. me. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'll wait on Hoyt to bring his up. Ralph Sauce, if you could get really up close to your score, so I can read that just a wee bit easier. Okay, so that's a. Uh, let's see, Hoyt. one nine zero. Nine seven zero is what I got. Let's see, I'll go ahead. One nine zero. I was so close. <laughs> I'll go ahead and I'll grab Hoyt first. Uh, 199, 210. Okay. 9, 210, and... Hoyt, you took... You, you are number four now. Okay. That would make you number number four on the leaderboard. <laughs> so, uh, it's not okay. enough to win. Oh, never All mind. Right. I'm looking at so, the one hit leaderboard. Okay. Hoyt, uh, with your score, with your raw score of a hundred and ninety nine thousand two hundred and ten, you have a multiplied score of two thousand and nine a hundred and seventy point five. And let's see here. And Oh, where's my mouse? There it is. 
Lost the mouse for a second. <laughs> okay, and Ralph Sauce, I'll go ahead and I'll punch yours in. It's 190970. One. Okay, and Ralph Sauce with your uh score of with your raw score of a hundred and ninety thousand a hundred and seventy. With the multiplier, you have a score I got, of I got 970, You have a score of two hundred and eighteen thousand six hundred and ninety-five point five. So uh, Hoyt, unfortunately, you will be going to the goulash. All right. And Ralph Sauce, you will be continuing on to the second phase of first to worst. Is my competitor already? Uh, no. uh, to or, be honest, do you know who it is. To be honest, I don't. We don't okay. Yeah, I don't know how to look that it's, up. Someone, someone will inform fine. inform us in the discords later yeah. on, uh, cool, or cool, in the cool. chat. So, all right. Well, your gamble paid off, Raffle Sauce. Congratulations. Well, yes, thank sir. thank you, sir. Thank that you, was, sir. It was a hard fight indeed. You put honestly, up a hard fight, sir. That was a really great run from the both of you unfortunately it was the multiplier that made the difference the multiplier baby yeah, that's right <laughs> all right i'll probably see you in that in that gulag very soon though don't yeah. you worry buddy i'm coming to get you goulash uh, <laughs> it's all right uh so anyway with that being said uh how do you guys feel about your run is there anything you would like to say to each other Oh, I got nothing to say. I felt great about no. my run. <laughs> I did too, except, you know, I kept, I kept getting hung up on, we were talking about it right before we went on these runs. We were talking about how difficult it is sometimes with those uh, those hidden ones. Man, yeah. those were getting me. Oh, those really? were getting me. Oh, the yeah. uh, stealth encryptions? Yeah, the, the stealth ste encryptions were really getting me. Yeah, the stealth encryptions can really, uh, can really mess with people on occasion. They're not paying attention. Right yeah. Now. Well, uh, I don't know what you rolled, but I got double m16s with with double drums dude so, I'm, I'm rocking the vz58 custom here i didn't even look <laughs> at where i didn't even look at where the stealths were i just sprayed oh and yeah i got them all oh yeah <laughs> honestly the uh, drums myself honestly the most impressive thing out of this run is uh ralph how uh you are able to do so well with a uh i wouldn't say mediocre but i would say slightly above mediocre uh loadout starting with the uh what you started USB. with the uh yeah you started with or a the, uh... mark 23 usb same thing. yeah <laughs> yeah and you picked up a single barrel shotgun and then god managed that to... thing i didn't realize it it had to be pulled back with the hammer i thought it was hammerless at first too i was and happy then... And then with a very, very slight upgrade to the pause both action <laughs> shotgun. Oh, God. God. <laughs> yeah, it was rough for a bit there. Yeah. Uh, yep. Yep. Thank thank the Lord, Lord Anton, for those Matic upgrade stations. That's what really came in handy for yeah, me. It's a shame. The, it's uh, usually my run saver. It's a shame the VZ only goes as high as the 30-round uh, drum Was mag. this a 30-round? Yeah. yeah. Honestly, I will hey, say this for it my – did the job. I will say this for my particular play style, the VC is actually a very strong weapon to get, but that's my play style, which is as far as far as everyone else is concerned is an unknown at the moment. But my play style is referred to as chaotic meaty. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I'm uh, what you might call robotic and boring. <laughs> <laughs> meat bot well anyway we definitely right, we definitely seen a lot of highlights out of this uh are there any questions from the chat i forgot we were uh on the main stage <laughs> yeah yeah wave to your audience hi everybody <laughs> <laughs> yes sir people people have watched those two amazing runs uh hoyt that was an incredible score uh, I'll have to say, uh, I'll, I'll, I, I got a question for both of you and I'm not going to ask why hot thoughts. Cause that one has been beat to death. This, this tournament, mm -hmm. uh, 
Do you guys find cucumbers cool? Cooler than oh, zucchini. Man. I'll say that. <laughs> of all of all the tubular green vegetables, cucumbers are the coolest, definitely. Ooh. Uh, let's see. Someone has asked, uh, what is it? I don't know if they're asking what's the highest score of the tournament, which is something I don't have access to immediately, but uh, we can turn this into a... Uh, what is your personal... What is your guys' personal best so far? Overall uh, or in Ori? Uh, in Ori. This is uh, it, one man. Hit. <laughs> yeah. This Hoyt, is, uh, did, my did one you, hit, I'm number six. Hoyt, did, yeah, you, I got... did you pull a personal best in this tournament run? Yeah, by uh, almost eight, uh, 800. Hell yeah. You love oh, man. it. Yeah, you congrats on that, man. You love, seeing, you love seeing personal bests in the tournament. Yeah. All right. Can't do any better. <laughs> All right. Well, I don't see any other uh, any other questions in the chat. I think everyone is just mostly just blown away with how 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 incredible your runs were. So. <laughs> Well, uh, go it would ahead. be too, to be honest. I mean, come on. Did you yes, see sir. that? There were hot dogs in there. I shot them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was, yes, that was a really good run. So I guess we'll uh, go ahead and we'll bring this uh, run to a close. Uh, to all of you out there, uh, keep practicing and keep getting good. And we will see you next time in the next round of First to worst. Bye, everybody. Bye. Shout out care. to all the moderators.